hey guys welcome to hey guys welcome back to my channel it's monday so i want to do this thing called makeup and beauty monday i did it like maybe one or two times last year but i actually want to make it a thing this year so this is going to be a segment where i'm actually talking to you guys about makeup doing a review or doing a tutorial or talking to you guys about something beauty related you guys have been asking me to do makeup tutorials for quite a bit so i want to make it a thing where i'm doing it quite regularly every week every monday so this is going to be a natural makeup look i actually did a similar look in my new year new hair video and also an original moxie video it was just a very natural look meaning i don't have any like under eye highlighting concealer or no highlight at all actually it's just a no must no fuss look so if you guys are into the more toned down looks then i'm guessing you will like this tutorial i do have a bold lip but obviously you can swap this out for a new lip if you like that's it for this look my hair is just doing its own thing today um but this year i want to do more requests this year i want to take more requests and actually do them a lot of you guys requested the uh head scarf tutorial so that's what i did yesterday i will leave a link up here and down below if you've missed that and if you have other requests let me know again i have some new projects that will be coming on this channel so make sure you stay tuned for that but i do want to make sure i still take requests and actually do those videos so leave your requests down below and without further ado i hope you guys enjoy this look okay so as you can see my face is completely bare i'm just gonna first start with so you prank. say you wanna take it slow Now that I primed my face, I'm going to go on with this Becca Concealer. This is the Ultimate Coverage Concealing Cream. And this is one of the best concealers that I've used. Now I'm just going to blend it out with a Real Techniques brush. This is the buffing brush. I have so many expensive brushes, but this one is still my favorite. I forgot to say. Since I'm not going to go in with a brightening concealer, because this is like a natural look, I'm just going to put a little bit of this concealer underneath my eyes because I do have dark circles so you say you want to make it up now that that's done I'm just gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows I'm using the Anastasia brow wiz Alright, so that's good enough. And I always just like go underneath with my finger to kind of warm up the concealer to kind of blend it out a little bit. So now I'm just going to go ahead and do foundation. And my favorite foundation to use at the moment is the Lancome Tint Idol Ultra. It's a great foundation and it's full coverage. And I'm just going to put this all over my face. I'm only using one drop. I mean, one pump. <laughs> and I'm using the same brush. The Real Techniques buffing brush. It's a full coverage foundation. But it's so natural on the skin. This is uh, the foundation that I use in both the pictures that I showed you guys now I'm gonna go into contour and I'm using the black up cosmetic contour stick and usually I just put this on the skin using the stick but since I'm doing a natural look I'm just gonna dab this brush uh, angle brush onto the contour stick 
and then use it so it's, it looks harsh on camera but it's not as harsh if I was to use the stick onto the face it's more a natural look I'm just gonna do it the same thing I'm actually using a little bit too much because I'm talking that's contour now to uh, blend the contour out and also to mattify my face um, and just you know set the foundation I'm using the Laura Mercier candle glow sheer perfecting powder and the color six I believe this is the darkest shade of this powder but I love it I bought this after I ran out of the mineralized skin finish from Mac and that took like four years for me to run out of that stuff and I bought this because it just came out at Sephora and it is really really great I love it okay so now I'm going to hit up the cheeks I always use NARS towels so I'm actually going to use another one that I hardly ever use and this is NARS Outlaw Now I'm just going to do the eyes, which is going to be really quick. I'm using one shadow, and that is Sable from the Lorac Pro Palette that I still absolutely love. I'm just using, I just like to use something on the lid so the lid isn't naked. That's the only reason why. Alright, now that I put um, some eyeliner in my waterline, I'm going to just go over... Um, my lash line with sable as well to kind of help blend out that eyeliner because it was supposed to be on my waterline but I got it on my lash line so mistakes <laughs> mm. oh eyeliner and mascara so for lips I'm going to use NYX liquid suede which is a cream lipstick and this is in the color Cherry skies. Wait it out, clear your doubt, let your feelings grow. I've been patient, I've been kind, gave you space to take your time. So, <laughs> it makes my lips look extra big. So that's basically it. I'm just gonna do something with my hair put on some earrings and be right back so that's it for this video again it's a plain no fuss no must look but it's still very put together and polished so if you guys have any questions leave them down below and i make sure to get to them and again leave me some requests down below if you have any Alright you guys, if you haven't subscribed, make sure you do that here and make sure you check out my latest video which I put up yesterday which is a head scarf tutorial which was requested. So that's it for this video guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.